Madden. <laughs> uh, I haven't played since... I think I only played till you made it Natalia. say is that you fell here from another world? Yeah, well, I should have business. So it's fine. But when you wanted to leave and go on to the next world, your path was blocked by some unknown god? Outlanders, your journey ends here. of mankind ends now. And just like that, the god took away my brother. And just like that, Some kind of seal was cast upon me, and I lost my power. <laughs> so whilst we used to cross world after world, we are now trapped here. So, they have been traveling world after world. Why? How many years ago was it? I don't know. But I intend to find out. After I awoke, I was all Person, alone. Right up until I met you two months ago. Does yeah, Paimon really owes you for that. Otherwise, Paimon likely would have drowned. So Paimon will do her best to be a great uh, guy. No. <laughs> we should head off. Let's get going. Yeah, let's get going. Sorry, wait a minute. Uh... First of all, um, how do you open it? Yeah. Uh, uh, I hear the menu. Alright. My age. Uh, seven. Sixty. And. Let me make 
some different audio language voices Japanese yeah download it wow it she writes so many voices but what I was saying I, I it was funny for me to see those cubes especially those red cubes because um it recorded in Kino Hearts the one who is from <laughs> How do you say it? Uh, the bugs are like that, and I was breaking my head out. So it was incredible. <laughs> and I don't know. I'm going to keep. I'm going to put it in English. And I'm going to put it in Japanese. I could have put it in Japanese Chinese to hear the original voices. <clears throat> Um, and well, I only played till I get the first part of the video when you meet Song Lee, and then I haven't played anything, so it was a nightmare to do with. <laughs> and well, it was kind of strange because I know how does uh. So writing looks like and everyone because if you go to Twitter it's filled with them. I'm going to find some lips. Uh let's go.
statue of the seven. Yes, and you have a note. There are a few of these statues scattered across the land to show among the seven gods. This yes. god King Paimon's not sure whether the god you're looking for is the animal. Paimon will take you to the animal god's place first and... So wait a second. This is a lie. But then when we go to the US, he doesn't know anything. As we all know, poetry and language flow like the wind. There'll definitely be someone there who knows about your brother. At least that's what Paimon thinks. Whether the gods actually answer yeah. you is a different story. You never know unless you try. Yeah, well, the god is a kind of drunkard and writer. Among the seven gods, Paimon's not sure. Paimon will take. Is she repeating herself? Wait, does she want me to jump? Ah, oh, no, B to navigate. As we oh. all know, poetry and language flow like the wind. Ah. There'll definitely be someone there who knows about your brother. At least that's what Paimon thinks. Whether the gods actually answer you is a different story. You never know unless you try. So let's hop to it. I just hope. That at least not so nervous because of the chest. My motor's a fucking chest. What the fuck? I'm going to have a good one. A reward on the road. All you had to do was just touch the statue. As much as they may want it, people in this world can never get a hold of powers as easily as you. Uh huh. It's because uh -huh. you're not from this world to begin with. Uh, obviously, little Paimon. If we keep heading west from here, we'll eventually reach Mondstadt. Mondstadt is the city of wind, so perhaps because you got power from the god of Animo, there are also lots of bards there, so perhaps one. Let's move then! The elements in this world responded to your prayers, and Paimon thinks that's a lovely sign. Okay, little girl. Um. <laughs> you got from the Statue of the Seven. I oh, Paimon's so jealous. Why doesn't Paimon get cool fighting powers? Thank you. 
I'll keep this close. I don't know this guy. I haven't met him, but he's hot. Arthur Parmato Chapter. Oh, do they mean Chapter? on the road. familiar sky. You were a pair of traveling twins passing through countless worlds during the journey, during the journey. Descending upon a continent named Tibet, you hoped that you would be able to enjoy your time there. But as you awoke among the failing stars, you saw the world in turmoil, a cataclysm raging across the land. You sought to leave this place and move to the next world. That must be the theory about uh, uh, war? But then a unknown of God stood before you, warming the way. His deity was spotless, floating over the water of chaos, looking down onto you. On you. The good took a look only keen away, and you were sealed and cast into deep slumber for the deeps. When you reawakened, the world was changed. The flames of war raged no longer. And nothing was left that looked familiar. How long have you been asleep? You had no answers, stars. Just began all yawning, seeking 
the date that you want to make a box. So, uh, no. no, I have. Let's go to have the voice one. On the road. It's going to be frustrating. <laughs> Alright. Mm. Yeah, I might need to ember for those things. Don't be afraid. It's all right now. I'm back. Is he talking to a dragon? <gasps> Talking to the dragon. Uh, yeah, Paimon gets why you're. Oh, what's that? There's some kind of shiny red thing. Let's go take a look. Uh, Be careful. Okay. Paimon doesn't have a good feeling about this. Paimon's never seen a stone like this before. All Paimon knows is that it's dangerous. Best we put it away for now. Okay, we've got it. Now let's get out of here. I'll keep this close. Protect you, stranger. I am Amber, outrider for the Knights of Favonius. Oh, 
You don't look like citizens of Monster. Well, we're not looking for trouble. That's what all the troublemakers say. Doesn't sound like a look in this mascot. What's the deal with it? <laughs> Can we use what's hey, this is worse than being a mascot. So to sum it up, you're tra well. Look, there's been a large dragon sighted around Mondstadt recently. It's not far from here. I'll escort you. Oh. Aren't you out here for some- I am, but not to worry. I can- Besides, I'm still not sure if I can trust you two just yet. That's not- Oh, a, uh, I'm this. sorry. Probably not something I should say as a knight. I give you my apologies, uh- That sounded so fake! Do you have something <laughs> against the type of language usage prescribed by the Knights of Havonius Handbook? <laughs> yeah. So, uh, I have to So, suspicious travelers, what are you doing in Mondstadt? She got separated from her brother during a really, really long journey. Paimon is her... Oh, looking for your family? Huh. Uh... Yeah, okay, let me finish my other stuff first, and then I can help you put up posters around the city. What exactly is it you need to finish doing first? It's simple. You'll understand in a bit. have been getting too close to the city recently. My task this time is to clear out their camp. little with your thanks for the backup how'd it feel uh, 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 you now that you mention it how is it these creatures don't seem like the type to set up camp exactly it's more normal for them to be much further out in the wilderness but because the dragon storm terror has been around a lot more recently our orchards have been destroyed uh. and the local market has when the storms hit we usually end up with at least a few injuries so the night so these annoying creatures have been getting close Exactly. That said, clearing, come with me. A responsible knight must make sure to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> Another target tracked down by Outrider Amber. Outrider Amber, reporting for duty. Just say the word if you ever need my help. 
Oh no, it's raining. Now my uniform will get all wet. Mondstadt Gliding Champion. Yep, that's me. Gliding Champion. Ugh, I'm just not used to this taste. Sorry, I can handle anything and everything. As long as it is... Sorry. I'm a recent writer of the Knights of Avernius in an age where all traders are becoming obsolete. She continues with her responsibilities. It takes a newcomer only a few days to feel right at home with a dispassionate girl. Whether it's before the god hunt, what hunt to sit for, the banks of Cider Lake, or the street tops of Red Rice, one can find treasure for this vigilant outrider in red anywhere. Once spotted by her, no suspicious in the duel can ever escape him to vision. Doesn't she have more details around here? On her video, when she appears? I'll keep this close. Achievements. Should I cook? Oh, are you travelers from around yeah. here as well? No, we just happen to be. I see. 
What? I'm Lynn, the survival expert of the Eat Before You Go. Picnic? Oh, Pike, my travel partner here is good at cooking. That's okay. Let's. You won't get a lot of chances like that. There are some mushrooms and meat in the barrel over there. Try making a chicken mushroom skewer. <laughs> I win. Is it done? Let me try. Hmm. Hmm. Enjoy my 
Now that's really tasty. Hi, Toad. With your culinary skills. Oh, I've got some raw and... Can we really have them? That's okay. You should be able to... There's also a restaurant in Mondstadt known as Good... Okay, thank you for the info. <gasps> <laughs> Introduce the city of wind, dandelion, travelers under the protection of the Knights of Havo. Finally, no more having to camp outdoors. But the city folk don't look too cheery. Everyone's been put out of place by. But everything will turn out fine as a law. Jean? Acting Grand Master of the Knights of. With Jean on our side, surely even the vicious storm terror will be no ma. Before I take you guys to the Knights of Havo, it's a reward for helping me. Hey! Uh, because this reward is used, but I'll treat you to a tri sticky hug. Come with me. <sighs> we'll head to the. Add Astra Abbott. are nowhere to be seen. What? Except for the local tavern oh, near the city wall over there. <laughs>
I've heard that Albert, being the leader of Barbara's fan club, sometimes gets bumps and bruises on purpose so that he can go to the cathedral <laughs> to see her. Paimon feels the Knights of Avonia should keep a closer watch on weirdos like that. But it seems that a month later, Albert uh, discovered that Bennett was managing to see Barbara far more than he was. Albert? On second thought, <laughs> Bennett does have the natural advantage when it comes to getting injured. What is this? A Let's Bother Barbara contest? <laughs> it's time for Paimon's little life tips. Little life tips? In Mondstadt, if there's something you can't fix, or there's something you can't get clean no matter what you do, if you ever run into something you can't handle yourself, you just need to shout this name into the skies. No. And everything that's troubling you will be swept away in an instant. So this is one of the tricks to living in Mondstadt. Hmm. Pretty impressive. If you want to adventure together with Benny's adventure team, you have to come prepared. Domains are very dangerous, so you should always take care to double and triple check your supplies in advance. 
Paimonster, that the Adventurer's Guild has compiled a list of 463 different ways of dying in these domains. If Bennett got you killed by accident, Paimon and Bennett would never forgive ourselves. <laughs> Why am I the only one dying here? Well, that's because according to the numbers, Paima can avoid 322 causes of death just by floating. I suddenly don't feel like exploring these domains. I've heard that if you give tavern owners a considerable tip, they'll be willing to share some information on the down low. You mean the angel share? But Master Diluc seems like a very rich man. How big a tip is considerable anyway? Huh. Maybe I might have heard wrong. <laughs> or maybe I might have heard this rumor in another world. You sure have been to many worlds, haven't you? <sighs> sure would be nice to spend a night at the Goth Grand Hotel. Paimon thinks so too. The rooms are sure to be big and clean. Still, I've heard Mr. Goth say that they've had all kinds of strange problems ever since the Fatui moved in. The electro systems that their mages brought in attracted a lot of dust with static electricity, which ended up killing a lot of those sissons. Then, someone mixed up the mist grass pollen and the pepper, and the agents ended up brawling amongst themselves, each insisting that the other owed them money for wine. <sighs> Hang in there, Goth Grand Hotel. <laughs> <laughs> that simple showing up place for no reason. It's because of that a foolish guy. Oh, the present I a wind glider. Outriders use them to ride the wind, and the people of Mondstadt, I brought you here to give it to you, so you can- Oh, you're really excited about- Well, that's because the wind is the heart and so- uh, Alrighty then, it's easy to use, but you still need to pay-
your fall with the power of a thousand winds. Now, concentrate. See yourself grasping the wind. Harness its energy. Who, who said that? to go up against the dragon. Are you a new ally? I'm used to or a new storm? <laughs> storm Terror is attacking Mondstadt itself! Kaya, Traveler, you've come at the right... Hold on, Amber. Oh, right. This is Kaya, our cavalry. These two are travelers from... From afar. Uh, long story short... I see. Welcome to Mondstadt. I understand the anguish. I'm not really sure why you're looking for the animal, but everyone has their secrets. <laughs> Relax. I won't press you for more. First and foremost, on behalf of the Knights of Favonius, I would like to extend our thanks to you for your help just now. Your fight to defend the city, the acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius, is also very. Uh, Trust me, this is it's the only one who actually thinks. Favonius headquarters. Let's head in. <sighs> Jean, what's the hurry? I thought we agreed to meet them here. There have been sightings of storm terror outside the city. Once we meet, we must... I'll lend a hand when the time comes. Aww. Jean, I I've brought them. <laughs> and once it was over, I brought them straight here. Aww. Mondstadt welcomes you when I am Jean, acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius. This is Lisa, our resident librarian. <laughs> oh, are you sweeties here to help us out? <laughs> You're both so adorable. Sadly, the timing is regrettable. Storm terror has caused, quite simply put, Mondstadt's elemental sphere and ley lines are now a for a mage, it couldn't get much worse. My skin is one elemental... <sighs> If it weren't for this interference, the Knights of Favonius would have better ways to help you than to... We simply ask that you repose in Mondstadt while we help you seek out your brother. Paimon will help too. 
Good. In that case, we need a plan. With Storm Terror now directly attacking Mondstadt, we may have an opportunity to cut this problem off at the sort. Lisa has revealed the sources of Storm Terror's power with her detection magic. Is that so? They're located in the abandoned Four Winds Temple. Storm Terror's ability to whip up these kinds of storms can be a trick. Our objective is to deal with three of the four. I trust everyone understands why we are only dealing. Paimon doesn't. Knights of Favonius, the storm is rampant. There's. All right, we need to take initiative. I heard you an Outrider Amp. Please forgive her. She talked to Amber sometime. <laughs> Great job, dreams, and, and ambitions, and other mates in the Knights of Avonius. Like, see, like anyone else in the city, protected by the Knights of Avonius, see two dreams of blooming the Hunters of Irma. Even if her skills are not enough to pass the rigorous selection trials, she still wishes to observe and learn from the every chance she gets. Aside from her training, she enjoys her current life, helping everyone in it. She can leave absolutely anything to me. That's her signature line. If there's anything that you need, Noel is glad to be your bed. Mm -hmm. 
I'm a bit... I am devoted to what I do, but make no mistake. I devote myself freely. A maid, to me, is the most liberating job there is. I'm a chef, a gardener, a warrior, a guide. I can be anything you need me to be. <laughs> so here in Mondstadt, alchemy is practiced out on the streets? Is... <laughs> How you want it. Yeah. Yeah. 
Ready, steady, go! Get from the Don't waste my time. <laughs> Tennis court. What? Waste my time. Huh? <laughs> 
<laughs> You're in for a little shock. It's not. Your life is mine. Try not to enjoy this too much. Yeah. <laughs> Give up. Submit. Astra Abbott. Over there. Wow! Of course, all you need is the ore. Anywhere. <sighs> Bring some back and I'll help you forge with no need. What do you want? Oh, yeah. These are okay, I guess. Ever find ore in the ideally when I'm not busy. A blacksmith's work when the craft is good, and there's nothing else. He's certainly committed to his work. Paimon will give him that. His temper isn't great, but leave it to him and he'll be able to forge what you need.
Kaya. <laughs> Kaya. I feel like running. Oh